as reliable as the new day's sunrise. Chip the brush, see what we can get done. So is the cooperation of a community. A couple people start down here, a couple people start up there. And I think it's common with any profession or any place that's a disaster. Clear all the... People come together. Get that stuff cleared out of the way and just blow it into the... Well, let's get the chipper hooked up and... Yeah. Dave Lynn's community has been cleaning up... Hey, give me a cut. ...since an EF1 tornado... Get that off. ...cut through Chardon in late August. Bearing homes and lives, but breaking branches and tossing timber around Meadowood Drive. I need firewood. God took care of it for me. He dropped, he dropped it and dropped all the trees for me, so thank you. <laughs> Plenty of firewood for the retired Beechwood firefighter. And on Friday, Plenty of hands to help cut, collect, and move it. I called just a couple firemen friends of mine, and I said, can you help me out? Well, the next thing you know, oh. this is what I got variety of, of firemen and, and people that live back here and we all got together we've got about three or four different fire departments represented that are down here helping this is part of what we do for each other first responders from Chardon and beyond responding to a different call for service in their free time I don't help people you know I mean it's that simple I mean, that's what we do for a living anyhow, so what's any different on our days off? As of right now, I would start moving firewood. It's part of a daily dedication to their team. This is part of what we do for each other. And reliability to the community. I told them you'll bring the chipper in here once we get piles in here. Anything we can do to help out and make people's lives a little bit easier, we're, we're going to try and do. Uh -huh, uh -huh. In Chardon, Catherine Ross, News 5.